Hello friends, let's install Windows Server 2016 Technical Preview 4 in uh, VMware Workstation 12. So already I created a one VM uh, with the name Windows Server 2016. Already I mounted the ISO image of uh, Windows Server 2016 Technical Preview 4 which is downloaded from Microsoft websites. And let's power on this virtual machine. So this is the first console we have to interact with the installation process and it's saying uh, select the language to install and that is by default selected English United States. You can also change the time and currency format as per your requirement. You can also set the keyboard or input method. I'm not going to change anything. Let's uh, click on next to start the installation and then click on install now to start the installation process. So here we have options to select the operating system which we want to install. Uh, first, we have a Windows Server 2016 Technical Preview 4. Uh, this option reduces the management and servicing by installing only what needed to run most server rules and application. It does not include the UI management tool. So if you want to manage the server, you can use the uh, server manager tool on other server. And here we have a Windows Server 2016 Technical Preview 4 with desktop experience means it includes the uh, GUI management console. So let's select the Windows Server 2016 Technical Preview 4 with desktop experience and then click on next. I select I accept the license terms and then click on next. It will ask you which type of installation do you want. We are going for a clean installation that's why I'm going to select custom install windows only. And here we have to specify the partitioning. Let's create a new partition of 100 GB and then click on apply. Click on OK. It will also create a one system reserve partition of 500 MB. Select the partition where we are planning to install this Windows Server 2016. Then click on Next. Now the installation process will uh, take some time to complete. And this is a similar process uh, which we see in the Windows Server 2012 and 2012 R2 installation. Uh, once the installation is complete, your server will uh, restart at least twice. So once your computer is start twice, uh, it will ask to set a built-in administrator password. Let's set the password and then click on finish. It will finalizing your settings and this will also take some time to complete. And once finalizing settings completes, then you will see the controller to delete screen. Okay, so let's log into newly installed Windows Server 2016. Let's press with the administrator password and then hit on enter. Let's click on start. Click on system. Yes. So as you are seeing, we have a Windows Server 2016 Technical Preview 4 installed on this VM. So that's it for this video demonstration. Thanks for watching this video.